Hello folks, how are we doing? We've got some perilous moons to work on today. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone's doing fantastically. Okay, let's get our camera set or the the microphone in the right position. I think our I think we're ready, Sarah. Should we head in there? We're doing some perilous moons today. Oh, someone just came. Sure, very cool. Half an hour is here, you'll love to see it. Whoa, you left me. Teresa, hello, are you outside? <laughs> How are you doing, Teresa? <coughs> now we're we are embarrassed. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, half an hour left. You, I see. <laughs> That's funny. We'll have fun at Barrows. Hopefully, you get some nice items for sure. I need to get back into Barrows with this week's competition. I was at Barrows with Teresa. Oh, Sarah was at Barrows with Teresa. I see. I'm good though. Trying to get 100 KC before bed. Very impressive. Had to join the event, of course, of course. Oh, wait, well, I don't need anything from here. What am I doing? <clears throat> All right, let's do this, folks. We got a little bit of perilous moons. Very nice. I like perilous moons a lot. It's a lot of fun. Fun mini game boss type thing. How are you? We're doing well. We're doing well. I'm uh, excited for uh, for the stream tonight. It should be a good time. And Sarah, how are you, how are you doing, Sarah? I want to answer for you. Hopefully well. <laughs> lurk mode engaged. You love to see it, Carter. Enjoy the lurk, friend. Enjoy the lurk. Give me the herb lore supplies. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Now, I don't know why this gets so desynced, but if you log out and log back in, it gets fixed. So my throat hurts, but otherwise doing fine. Oh yeah, I forgot about your throat hurting. That's no fun. That's no fun at all. You think you've been on and off? Not too bad. Well, that's good that it's not been too bad. Just hurts right now. That is unfortunate. Sore throats are the worst because then you feel like you're going to get even more sick as time goes on, you know? Okay, we got all of our fish. Very nice. Yeah, that's the worst part about it. Is that it's very likely to turn into something even worse. Where'd that fan go? I'm going to turn it off, actually. <laughs> I changed my mind. I'm cold now. Oh, I always forget to make the potions. I need to make the potions. Can't forget the potions. Impending doom indeed. You hate to see it. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you two in there. Enjoy your fishing and herb loring and whatnot. Oh, I will. <laughs> Got a little eclipse moon to start here. Very nice. Oh, I forgot today was the Perilous Moons event. No worries. No worries. Feel free to join if you want, but if you need to spend some time at Barrows, that is totally fine. Get that KC up, it should be fun for you. 
to hopefully get some nice items as well. Because you're killing it in the lead right now, if I'm not mistaken. Teresa's got a chokehold on these events, honestly. <laughs> Here we go, very nice. Get a little bit of weapon kicking, or no weapon kicking, I think. I think we're supposed to be over here for this one, yeah. Very nice. Lots of people doing uh, doing Perilous Moons tonight. This seems to be a pretty common world for it, 45. I feel like I've been in other worlds that weren't as, uh, weren't as crowded for whatever reason. Also, Sarah slash anyone else doing Perilous Moons, I uh, I realized that they uh, they do their special or the the uh, not the special attacks. Of course, they do the special attacks once it hits the thing, but um, they uh, they only hit every or like when the the actual thing switches every two hits. By the way, so every two hits it switches, so you can time it pretty well if you just look at when they hit. Also, everyone pretty much just skips this middle one now. No one really does this one anymore, so I just kind of stand here and hang out. Because it just gains a little bit more health and it's not really a problem. Funny thing is, I did the quest yesterday just for this event, but just got sucked into Barrow's event. And Prob's going to go to bed anyways, but have fun. Oh, no worries, Teresa, no worries. Hope you have fun at Barrow's. Hope you have fun at Barrow's. Dang, I never had my phone and PC sync up for the live stream uh, before. Oh, it'll, it's always a bit off. Oh, that's awful. That's unfortunate. That is not fun. <laughs> Oh wait, it's working this time. Oh, I see what you mean. I see what you mean. I see, I see. I read the message wrong, my bad. Misu was killing it in Boss of the Week. Really though, really though, with all that Barrows, Casey. Someone's gonna die here, my goodness. No Brassier. Therese is absolutely killing it in boss of the week, it's true. I'm gonna get another item. I spent a little while since I've had an item here at uh, at Perilous Moons, I feel like. Just hanging around uh, for Dale so I could show him Barrows, but I haven't seen him. Oh, sad, yeah. Get that item, hopefully, hopefully. Yeah, it'd be fun for Dill to start Barrows. I think that'd be good for him. Getting into your first bossing experience is always a good time. Holy cow, look how many people are here, jeez. A lot of people doing Perilous Moon tonight. There's like 10 people in here, at least, jeez. Now half an hour is here, very nice. Surely we get it before the special. Surely we get it before the special. Hey Matt, how you doing friend? Very nice to see you. Oh, almost, very sad. Kill this Jaguar instead, I suppose. They're all here for you, baby. <laughs> Everyone on World 45 knew it was the live stream.
This is actually stream so sad. Oof, you hate to see it. Well, I'm glad you're here today, Matt. I'm glad you're here today. Always nice to have a Matt in the stream. All right, Shirley and Item on our first chest tonight. What do we get? What do we get? I'm going to close my eyes and hear if I can get a collection log. No, I did not get a collection log. Very sad. Very, very sad. I was busy watching the nastiest movie with my family. I saw well, 10 cent of it. Look away for the rest. Oh, was it like a gore movie or what? Oh, Saw X. Oh, you're saying Saw X. I thought you said Saw and then it was a typo. Saw X is crazy, I hear. All of the Saw movies are, honestly. I've seen like YouTube clips of some of them and they're just nuts. I'm not the biggest gore person, but I'll watch the clips on YouTube sometimes. first saw was pretty good. Yeah, I haven't seen any of them, but I know that uh, people really like the, the first one or two or something like that, especially. Not sure how the, the newer ones are, but I haven't seen any of them, so I haven't seen the others, yeah. Bro, so nasty. I never liked them, but my gosh, the writers have to be psychopaths, honestly, to come up with that kind of stuff. You gotta have, gotta have at least a creative mind, for sure. <laughs> they might be understa understating it. <laughs> No one saw the guy on the, oh, let's see, on the floor coming and set the tone for sure. I'll bet it was crazy, whatever it was. First off, for context, I think I know actually because it's the... So, spoilers if anyone wants to not know about Saw, but uh, I think it's the first guy that died, right? Like in the very first one. I think I did see a YouTube video about it. I've watched all Saws, but this one was different, really. Like that first guy that died in the trap where it was going toward the wall with the, with the, uh, um, with the razor sauce or whatever. Is that right? I hate Blood Moon. I get it to uh, to 20 HP and then it heals an extra 100. Yeah, it's kind of rough. I know they want to change it. That's my understanding anyway, is that they want to do some adjusting to it, which is good. Seems like uh, a lot of people help hold that sentiment. Now that I've realized you can skip the the uh, this part, this next part of the fight, I've actually really started to like the blue moon. Because there's a little bit of AFKing time that's kind of nice. Then I watched Roadhouse with my brother. Much better movie. Never seen Roadhouse. And she has skyrocketed because of Coliseum. Oh, did it really? Interesting. I'll have to look into that. I need to get an SGS again, eventually. Not not right right now, but at some point. Don't have it anymore. <clears throat> Excuse me. Just came out in the last few days. Oh really, what's it about?
I'm on the wrong side. I thought it was this side. I could have sworn. Zillian Hall was in it. He's the next UFC fighter. Oh, that one, that one. A couple Bardas top fights from happening, and uh, Conor McGregor is in. I, oh, I saw a, uh, a clip from that today. Actually, I didn't realize that was from that movie. The movie, the, the, the clip was really cool. It was great. Just some sketchy CGI. Everyone's in again, like Post Malone is in the first few minutes, and they had the CJ arms on him for the punch, so the punches look good. That's funny. CGI, right? That's funny. Yeah, I definitely saw a scene from that on TikTok. I didn't realize that's what it was, though. I think Blood Moon's kind of beating me up today. I'll be back in heaven. It sounds good, Matt. See you soon. Enjoy whatever you're doing. Blood Moon's healing a lot on me today. My goodness. Might actually be my best blood so far. Oh, really nice. Surely an item for Sarah. Have you had an item at all from blood or from uh from Perilous Moon Sarah? If you have, I don't remember it. Add little darts, but not really, right? Surely a nice item for you this time. Or a bunch of swamp tar. <laughs> then I guess this RNG will go to me. And we're here for killing the mobs outside. Does a chance on the roll mechanics yet? I don't think so. No item for me, unfortunately. I think they don't. Oh wait, I see what you mean. Like on the loot, like barrows. Maybe they do. I don't think it's been confirmed if it is. But maybe. That's a good thought, actually, Teeters. Like killing the, I would, I don't know, maybe. The sulfur nagwas and whatnot, and like the worms and everything, maybe. That'd be interesting. Probably just the sulfur nagwas, if anything, but I don't know. I keep thinking it's done. There we go. I like this part. This part feels nice to to do well on as well. That dang flickering. It'll get you. It'll get you. Oh, I need to sip up here. Make a cuppa. Surely an item for somebody tonight.
Oops. I've seen a ton of people bringing thralls in here, but it looks like this guy is. Maybe I should bring thralls. Maybe that's a good idea. You just spend so much time not actually attacking that it feels like maybe not, you know? One more hit on this blue moon here, and we should be good. Very nice. I love the self-sustaining uh, aspect of this of this uh, whole encounter. I think it's really fun. Got unique? No way. Half an hour. What'd you get? What'd you get? Congratulations. Maybe it's in the spam chat. Ooh, the dual Maku Heidel or whatever it's called. Very nice. This is some crazy RNG for me. I'm, I'm, I'm happy for you, friend. That's awesome. Very nice. I just forget which side it is. Huge congrats there, nobody. I like how there's so many people at the boss. I think that's really fun. Oh, that's a big heal. An 80, my gosh. This is the one, Teeters. Let's see it. Let's see it. Blood Moon, stop healing. <laughs> there we go. One more hit. Easy. Abracadaniel. <laughs> With the Abracadaniel, surely we get it. Nothing. Very sad. Very, very sad. But we did get a decent amount of Adaladdle darts, which is, I guess, not worth very much, actually, now that I think about it. But <laughs> kind of cool either way. We got six items. We got the um, the uh, the water orbs, which I think are the most valuable thing in general that you can get other than items, of course. That's KC35. What do I have? Let's check the collection log. 
Moons of Peril. I have two, no, three items, and I got them pretty early on. I think it was like 22 KC when I got my third item or something like that. I'm excited to get the Blood Moon Spear, though. That'll be fun, because I think it goes weapon, head, legs, body every time, if I'm not mistaken. So that'll be cool. How's it going? Any uniques yet? I'm 50 try. Oh my gosh, Fishy, that's awful. Doing well. How are you, friend? Doing well. I'm, uh, I've got three items in, I think, uh, 27 KC, and then I'm probably about 10 or 15 dry is where I'm about at. Sorry to hear that you're so dry, Fishy. That's awful. Hopefully some luck for you soon. Nice how hard you hit during this phase. I think you hit. I think your max hit is, is increased during this this part, it feels like. And almost like your minimum hit it would seem too. That's what it feels like anyway. So why do we skip Braziers now? So the way that it works is um, the the Blue Moon heals, but if like during that phase, but if you don't do the Braziers, then it heals more, but it's really not that much more. And so you can, it, it's technically fast to DPS, but it's so minimal. It heals like 10 or maybe 20 more is what my understanding is. I think it's like 12 or something like that. If you just skip them. So people just skip them now for that reason. Yeah, kind of a cost cost benefit analysis. It says it pierces your defenses, that mean I made a mistake. No, that just happens. That just happens. Yeah. Or it has something to do with your defense or something. Maybe I think it's I think it's the um the eclipse moon that it has something to do with your defense when it like reflects the attack back at you. I'm still not sure. I think people are still trying to figure out exactly what things mean. Done with the blue moon, time for the blood moon. Surely it goes better than last time. I think it's just random from my experience. Could definitely be wrong though. Yeah, I, I would guess random, honestly. But um, I wonder if they're gonna reveal, like release some actual mechanics in a blog post or on a, on a Q and A or something. That's my guess. That's what my guess is eventually.
That'll love when you run through the blue moon or the blood moon or any of them. I think it's bedtime for me. GG's, good luck with drops. Those you get tacits. I think those are worth the most. Oh, nice. That'd be nice if I got tacits then. You take care, Teresa. Very nice to see you, friend. Have a nice night. Have a very, very nice night. Went too early there. Yeah, the boxes are pretty rough. Yeah, I think so. In a thing that Jagex posted, they're going to try to fix that. They have like a big long list of things that they're uh, that they're kind of committing to fix eventually with the Varlamore release in general, and that was one of them. So should be better soon. They didn't give a time frame for them, but eventually is the idea. I just always click the shadow, and then you're guaranteed to hit it unless it disappears. Of course, does that flickery thing, which is no fun. I didn't realize you could click the shadow. Yeah, yeah, clicking the shadow fishy is way easier. Just click the shadow. Anything that has a shadow actually in the game, you can do the same thing with. So I'm trying to remember what else it is, but um, there's there's other ones too. Um, what else is it? There's something in the game that also has shadows that are easier to click. Maybe it's something to do with. Nope, I don't remember. There's something though. Actually, tied I really like Blood Moon. I really like Blood Moon too. I really like it a lot. I think the uh, the Jaguar part's really fun. No item there, very sad. I hate Blood Moon, the health is, uh, the, health, the healing is rough sometimes. Yeah, the healing is what's rough about it. But I like the actual fight. Very satisfying specs, yeah, it's true. here because it's being glitchy so if you want this to get fixed here you just have to log out and log back and then you can actually do the thing where you uh where you align your net and it'll catch every single one no idea why but that's what someone on reddit figured out is that uh, somehow it desyncs with the state of something and um like some server thing and so if you log out and log back in it resets it which is really nice or you can just afk obviously but So if like you're trying to align and it isn't going, yeah. If you align and it's not working, then uh, then that's what that's what you need to do is just log out to get it fixed. For whatever reason, it's just glitched. that didn't know you could relog to fix it yeah i only noticed or found out when i saw the reddit post but it's super weird that it does that i don't know why well, i'm just ahead of the shield unfortunately i feel like the shield is kind of buggy too there are times when i'm definitely behind it and still get hit but i don't know
I'm really gonna get a fighter torso one of these days. There's one corner where it always bugs out. Yeah, yeah. It's so weird. I've also learned on this phase that you don't actually have to click on the boss. You just have to be facing the right direction. And so I just zoom out like this, go from top down, and then just uh, move, just click one tile away from me and do it that way. They were gonna fix that um, that uh, that delay when you're drinking from the the tea as well from the bonfire. So that'll be nice too. Say a lock. That's impressive. Missed the first 45 minutes. My bad, no worries, no worries, Tank. Very nice to see you, friend. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a great Monday so far, friend. We're just doing some perilous boons today, so having a good, good time here. Haven't gotten any items yet, but uh, half an hour did. Nobody, so that's kind of fun. Always a good time to see people get items. See the Neuralink patient? No, what is that? Ooh, very sad chest there, unfortunate. Musk's new thing? Oh, that thing. Interesting. Did someone do it? Like the brain hooking up to a computer or something? It's kind of crazy. You cold? 
The brain chip, really? So they did that? Crazy stuff. We welcome you to the Eclipse Moon, Sarah. Half an hour and I are both here. Can't wait to play OSRS with my mind. It'll be a great time. It'll be a great day. <laughs> Trying to kill two... Try killing two, three of the things just outside from this what happens. You know, sure, yeah, I'll do it. Of the Sulfur Nogwas. Maybe get lucky on the Sulfur Blades. Let me spend my... Uh, Spend my mind. Oh, let's see. Sorry, I'm going to reach out in just a second after I finish this. My mind wood cutting while driving. That would be nice. That would be nice. Oh yeah, how's it going, Zolagon? Very nice to see you, friend. If you're linked with OSRS, I will chop while driving. That would be nice. That'd be a good way to do it. <laughs> That's funny. That'd be crazy. Something like that. Got a butterfly net here. That doesn't seem like the right weapon. Did you get another haircut? Not another one. I got one uh, probably last week, I guess. Or maybe the week before, I forget. I think it was last week, early last week. I'm just not wearing a hat, so maybe that's what it is. Don't spread that yet over. I just woke up. Honestly, the yawns are getting me today. Your hair looks different again. Oh, really? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's maybe I didn't do it as tall today. I don't know. It's funny. Do you style it for the stream? I style it normally when I'm when I don't wear a hat. So I guess yes for the stream, but just because I style it anyway. So. 423k till max melee. Very nice, Jared. Very nice. Congrats on being very close. Watch Butterfly Net be some uh, secret meta like bugged item or something. Wow, that'd be crazy. Congrats on that, Olsen, for sure. Uninstall the game after maxing it. That's the only way to do it. Just the blood moon left, folks. Just the blood moon left. Who you come the boss with? Just, uh, let's see. We've got half an hour and Sarah, my wife, are both here, so... Well, I think those are the only two people that I've seen here so far. Hair's probably just getting longer, probably. RWC, your gold. They'd buy an IRL patch of Ireland and sell capes. That's the way to do it. I'd go. I'd buy one. Come join, Zolgon. You can come if you'd like. Anyone is free to join. Happy to have anyone. Just get a Cavalier IRL. What is a Cavalier, but just uh, just a fedora, basically, honestly? Oh, no, wait, the Cavalier's the big one. I'm thinking, I'm thinking the, um, no, the Cavalier is the small one, right? Huh? The Cavalier's the one that I wear, yeah, yeah, yeah. What am I thinking of? I'm thinking of the, the big one, too. The beret is small, okay, maybe that's what I'm thinking. Community event, it's a lot of fun, it's a lot of fun. Musketeer, that's the one I'm thinking of, the really big one.
almost got the blood moon down before the spec, but we didn't quite. Very sad. I'd run if I have the quest done. Too lazy for all that these days. Fair, fair. Put James in backpack and you can cosplay as yourself. That's the real way to do it. Alright, we're killing some sulfur naguas at the request of Teeters here. And if we get nothing, then Teeters is instantly permanently banned from the live stream. That's the real that's the rules. Unfortunately. I don't make them, I just follow them. That's a bit harsh. I again I don't make them, I just follow them. Fair play, I hope he gets banned. <laughs> you know, you know. This is number three. I'll kill five and see how that goes. And then we'll open the chest, see if we can notice an effect at all. Because I'm guessing that's about what it would be. Similar to Barrows, you know. You kill a few of them, you get some extra points toward uh, to your loot rolls and everything. So, we will see. We will see. The thing that makes me think not is that there's no, like, percentage counter like there is in Barrows, you know. Let's ban him and master for him for potting. The real punishment. Alright, surely an item here. Nothing from there. But then again, of course, if it does increase loot chance, like of the actual loot, then we would never know unless it... Unless they release it, because that could have just been an unlucky high one, you know? Percentage counter isn't uh, vanilla, though, is it? I think... Oh, maybe it's not. Maybe it is just Runelight. You dunzo teeters. Unfortunate. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's not. Maybe I'm just... No, I think it is. Maybe I'm just spoiled by Runelight. I don't know. If I'll see myself out, you hate to see it. I think they added it. Oh, really? How's the new Barrows Red going? How's it going, Tira? It's going well. It's going well. We're having a good time. Hopefully getting some items today. That would be very nice. How are you doing, though, Tear? That's the real question. How are you today? How's your Monday going, friend? That's what we really need to know. Don't know why they compared this to Barrow. Seems a tad bit more intense. Yeah, I think the comparison is more along the lines of the fact that you don't have to kill all of them, that you get pieces from them and things like that. But it is definitely harder than Barrow's. You're definitely right about that. Barrow's is a lot more... A lot more click and relax than this is. Got some nice log slots that I put in the Discord. Just happy to actually have a reason to do OG Barrow's. Very nice tier. I did some perilous moves over the weekend and was fun to be. It's nice. Glad to hear it. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh. We already saw those. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got, you got, what was it? The, uh, the Guthin's chain body, maybe? And then the Aram's rope skirt, I think? Am I remembering that right? Those are awesome. Now that I'm finally doing Barrow's enough to fill out some of the log slots, you'll love to see it. Is your wife maxed? No, she is not maxed. She's close. What, what's your time? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> She's not. She's not max. What are you like? 15, 16, 1700 total level? Huh? She's about 1700 total level. Yes, sir. Very nice. Tier, very nice. Big congrats on those.
she the one with the inferno? Yeah, definitely. No, she's uh, she's working on her fire cape right now. She got it in leagues, but she got very close last time. Made 4.5 mil in 40-ish runs. Couldn't be more happy. Very nice. I spent my whole cash stack last week. There you go. That's a good time to, to make some money back then. Not see her, or uh, Dwagon, I mean, you'll see her in a minute. Uh, she's a, I'll probably catch up to her at Blood Moon in just a second. Or maybe not, I don't know. But her name is Mrs. Chandlar in YouTube, but then uh, G.I.M. Sarah in the game, so... She completed the Coliseum first day I heard. I hear that, uh, I heard that she was the first one to complete it, actually. I hear she's got the, uh, the world record for that. There she is. She's so humble. Not worrying her in for an okay. She doesn't want to make us all feel bad is what it is. It's easier to bring just one weapon. When I went, I brought a Fang Whip and a Blizzle Bludgeon. I, uh, I'm doing the rebuilds here, so I just don't have a ton of money to buy other weapons, but I think that you're probably better off bringing, uh, bringing a Fang Whip and a Bludgeon, because then you have each of the combat styles, you know, each of the attack styles. I think that's probably the way to do it. If you created the new Hooks Walk, I heard, Sarawak, it was impressive. I remember her doing that just this last week. It was crazy. Let's check the line plugins for five caves. There's one that shows you where the next mobs will spawn on the next season. Oh, really? I didn't know there was one that showed the spawns. That's cool. Gmaw for Kush. Maybe I could do a Gmaw for Kush. That might work. I'll have to look into that. I heard it ain't accurate for the plugin for the Pi Caves. Oh, really? Interesting. We saw an FC spawn predictor. That's nice that there is one. It worked accurately for me. That's good. That's good. Oh, sorry, sir. Surely an item here. You know what? Let's uh, let's get a diet coke, just for the good luck here. That's what we'll do. <laughs> Gosh, I'm loud when I have my headphones on, aren't I? <laughs> I take my headphones off and I keep talking the same volume, and I'm like screaming. <laughs> I've been a Blood Moon. Sorry, everyone. Oh, no worries. They, would, they know you were just figuring out some new strats. <laughs> Setting new metas and whatnot. Ooh, Sarah, we're going to loot together. I'll watch yours first. Diet Coke ASMR, by the way. Ooh, nothing there. Very sad. Nothing here either. You hate to see it. So group Iron Man, yeah, she's a group Iron Man with me, technically. But I don't play that account anymore, so. <laughs> Not even water orbs tonight? Very sad. What's your favorite moon in this raid? I think my favorite one's here. It's gotta be the Blood Moon. I really like the fight. I think it's very fun. The more I do all of them, the less I have favorites, though. Because I'm getting better. Like, I'm a lot better at this face, for example, than I used to be, so. I don't mind him too much, honestly. Any particular of any particular room, you know. Still not perfect, but getting better. This used to be my least favorite one. I used to really struggle with this one, but I'm doing definitely a lot better now, so that's good. Ok, 
I have to know, uh, is it tier or tear? Like tear, oh, tear or tear, like tear or tear, I see. Like tear, like tearing paper, but I've heard both for a long time. Oh, tear, cool, I'll change it to tear then, my bad. <laughs> Tear, that makes sense, that makes sense. Is tear even a word? It is. It's, uh, the way that the, the context I know it from is in the Bible. <laughs> it doesn't know the definition. It's like thorns and weeds, I think. It's like a weed, yeah. Like separating the weeds from the tares is what it is. That different from Tor? I suppose maybe. The more you know, the more you know. I think there's an old usage of tear that's the same as Tor, though. Oh, really? Interesting. I did not know that. Again, in the Bible. Right, right. Why are you using those dual blades? What dual blades? Oh, the, the mock UI tools or whatever? I don't have them. Are they better? All I've got is this handy dandy whip. I don't know if they look cool. They really do. You're not wrong about that, it's all gone. They are pretty neat looking. Like a cool, good version of Torax Hammers. Yeah, that's kind of what I imagine them to be. <clears throat> no shot, I just hit like six zeros when he was on 19 health, very sad. to be a good stab weapon i don't think it's particularly good no it's uh i think it's really only used in the set itself with guthans you know <clears throat> i wonder if people will ever want the eoc in this game i have to imagine some people wouldn't be against it but i think the vast vast majority would always say no fair yeah yeah mostly for the for the guthan set itself Time for Blood Moon, very nice. Just in time for the blood. Got so much stuff done in OSR today, very nice, Matt. You'd love to see a lot of stuff getting done. I can then do this new weapon if you like. I mean, if you want to, I won't. I wouldn't say no. But I won't make you do that. <laughs> I would return it, obviously. My word is my, or my stream is my word, I suppose. Or I could always give you collateral or something if you'd like. Oh, I can't move. Oh my gosh, I'm doing terribly. Is my man using the rapier on Slash? 
I think he is. Oh my goodness. Because I was kind of thinking the most, the, uh, the MGP game was kind of complicated in the terms of gameplay. Um, if the EOC was in the game, bossing would be easier. Yeah, I wonder... I wonder what percentage of the game of the player base wouldn't mind that, but I obviously would mind. I like the simplicity of it, you know. Oh wait, in the test room sounds good. Nobody sounds good. I can't imagine most people would be for it, though. Actually, I I can pretty much say that with certainty. I think. <laughs> yeah, like Missy mode in it. Yeah, I don't know. That's true. People with EOC. No worries, Tear. It's um, it's evolution of combat, and so it just changed the way that combat works. Like, gosh, I can't click right now. What in the world, dude? I'm gonna die. It's basically a um, a big, big overhaul to the way combat works in the game. So like, there were special attacks that you could do, like special regen bars that would go through in RS3. Exactly. Yeah, that's what it is. RS3 has evolution of combat, so. Hey, sir, hope your night is going good. It's going fantastically, Royal Demon. How are you, friend? How on earth are you doing? Very nice to see you. I think it wasn't very about popular, mostly due to the trade limits and the added pay to win in RS3. Yeah, there's a lot that they changed, so. I know EOC was a big part of it, but. Lots of. Lots of various uh, uh, variables in it. I don't know if that's the right word. Factors, I should say, but. Every single reason why OSRS is a thing today? Exactly. Exactly. One of the less, uh... The less good decisions that Jack X has made over the years. Well, the more complicated the bosses they develop and the less the mass populace of the game will be able to do. Oh, I see. Might be, yeah, maybe it'll, uh, I don't know. I feel like they do a pretty good job at, uh, at doing it, but we'll have to see how it goes as they continue it. I'm living a little about to get back on that grind. Can't wait to get my fiber hooked up in a few days. Very nice world, even that'll be awesome. I'm excited for it. I've been hearing you talk about it on Discord. Honestly, I might hop on RS3 just to see my old account. I wish I had access to my old account, so that'd be so cool. I just definitely don't anymore. It's been so long since I had that email or password. Let's see what we get. Nothing very sad. All right, let's see how they do, nobody. We'll see how they do. I'll do one round, and then I'll give them right back to you. Let's see how they do. I'm excited. These are cool. These are really cool-looking weapons. Now, all I have to do is immediately log off and sell them at the Grand Exchange. <laughs> I wonder why there's a delay in taking more potion or more more vials. It seems so weird to me. <clears throat> like I can't think of a reason they'd need to have done that, but I don't know. Oops, I'm not uh, doing this right. Let's log out and come back so that we can reset the server. Maybe you no know, clue how I even have access. If I even kept access to my or how I even kept access to my account, but I'm pretty sure I. Hooked it up to Steam when I downloaded RS3. Oh, that makes sense. Interesting. Yeah, I definitely don't have mine. I'd love to have it just for nostalgia's sake. Just, you know, to have Chandler 81 again, but alas, I do not, so. I very, very much do not. It's a lot different. I would play if it wasn't so complicated. Yeah, it's, uh, it's an interesting one for sure. Alright, let's see how these dual Maku Heidels do. 
Do you think those new items will stay at around 2 mil each or crash hard in a few days? I don't know. I think they'll definitely go down a little bit, but I wouldn't be surprised if they stayed up. More, more than Barrow's items for sure, but... I don't know, we'll have to see. I'm really interested to know that or to see that for myself half an hour. It's very satisfying to have the dual hit splats. I like that a lot. <clears throat> They're pretty fast, aren't they? Remember when Dungeoneering came out and all my friends kept dragging me there? Yeah, I never did Dungeoneering. I wish I had. Holy cow, I just got smacked around by that boss. What the heck? Eclipse Moon, my favorite stage. It's a fun one. It's, uh, unfortunately, it's my least favorite one, Matt, but I don't I don't dislike it as much as I used to. I used to dislike it a lot, but now I've gotten this, uh, this phase a little better, so that's good. Ooh, a 1017, that's nice. Was not uh, was not something my nine-year-old brain could keep up with. Yeah, no, me neither. I never never did any any of that when I was playing back in the day. Dungeoneering was good, TVH. Honestly, a lot of people liked Dungeoneering. They've added little mini things that are similar-ish to it in a way, in different ways. Like this, honestly, has some aspects of Dungeoneering. Things like, um, you know, uh, Crystal Gauntlet and Corrupted Gauntlet. As well as, like, um, what else? Honestly, uh, Cox in a way, too. Why well, I'm not doing very well right now while I'm talking and trying to do this at the same time. I only just bought a dungeon here. <laughs> That's funny. Way back in the day, I used to bought uh, Swamp Tire. I was only thinking they were going to bring it over when they released the fold to bring a new skill. That would have been cool, honestly. That would have been really cool. I guess it's more of a... I think a lot of people's criticism of, of Dungeoneering, though, is that it's more of an event and less of a skill, if that makes sense. Like, a, like you know, a... a, a yeah, I guess an event, like a like a mini game or an activity is the word I'm looking for, but I don't know. I was a big summoning nerd, absolutely loved it. Yeah, I wish I had played it, but I, I just never did. I remember I had a wolf at some point, and that's probably all I ever did, but... never liked it running the same dungeons over and over again was lame yeah i know some people loved it some people hated it it's definitely what it seems like it's uh there's a lot of polarizing things on this game to be fair and 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 rs3 as well in rs2 back in the day and whatnot you know i thought it was fun but always had friends to play with that makes sense best content was stealing creations i love stealing creation holy cow that was such a fun mini game I don't even remember what it was. I just remember loving it. <laughs> oh, do these have a special? They do have a spec. Oh, you have to have the full Blood Moon set, it looks like. There's a minigame with skilling and PvP. I do remember that. I do remember that that they had rewards of like these different I, uh, tools, right? Like the clay tools or something like that. Anyone here like anime? The only anime that I've ever watched here is um, Attack on Titan. And I only watched like 10 episodes of it, but I really liked it. Excuse me. And I really should get back into it. Just not something I've spent a ton, a ton of time doing, honestly. Or watching, I mean. You can earn points for your team by being a skiller or killing the enemies. That's yeah, see, that's fun. I like that. I 
think, or maybe Clay, they gave like double XP was broken. Yeah, that's what it was. They gave a lot of extra XP. I remember that. Was it double? That'd be nuts. Wouldn't be surprised though, honestly. <laughs> Look at that sexy Seracnus cudgel. You love to see the Seracnus cudgel. It's a good looking weapon. Hot take, bring back double XP weekends. Ooh, that is a hot take. That is a very hot take. I remember loving double XP weekends. <laughs> Not sure it'd fly today, though. I'd want EOC before double XP. There's a lot of a lot of opinions about uh, about those two particular things for sure. What's your favorite looking weapon in the game? Matt, I love the Grazi Rapier. I love the look of the Grazi Rapier. I think it's such a cool weapon. Easily my favorite weapon in the game. The Shadow looks really cool too, I think. Um, but yeah, the Grazi Rapier for sure. I don't have the same amount of... Uh, let's see. Zoom up here. Of time I did as a wee little child. That's fair, that's fair. I hated EOC, but the current pace of the game seems like it will be there within a couple of years. I think that it's just so... That people are so blatantly against it that I don't know if it'll ever happen, you know? But we'll see. We'll see. Looks like someone dropped their grimy Harrowlanders. Looks like we got some Adel Adel darts. Not bad, not bad. Alright, I'll hang out here waiting for you. Nobody. Make a, make a revamp of it. I could see that for sure. That could happen. Zamoraki and Hasta. Actually, I'm going to wait over here and get more supplies if that's cool. Zamoraki and Hasta is a cool one for sure. It's a good looking weapon. Oh, you're over here. I see. I see. Trade with half an hour. Thank you for letting me borrow your weapon, sir. It was fun. I liked it. I love that it's so satisfying to have those double hit splats. It's really nice. Let's grab some more herb lore supplies here. There we go. Get some grubby saplings going. Ooh, that's too many. Let's pick them so fast, it's hard not to. Have you gotten the sulfur daggers yet? I haven't. No, I have not, Tank. Hey, Tank, uh, Music, how you doing, friend? Very nice to see you. Hope you're doing well. Got to log out and log back in for that sync. They were voting against... They were against raids back in the day, yet they were voted in. Now they got AFK theme in the game. Times are changing. Times are changing. You're not wrong about that. That's that's surely... Dare, for sure the case. I go and there we go yeah I gotta get those though tank I gotta get those the last is gonna be my last one I was literally falling asleep in the middle of blue moon oh no <laughs> sounds good Sarah sounds good good to see you though music hope you're doing well friend let's see what number is this I don't know Albion has pretty fun combat for how simple the game is. I hear people like it a lot. I'll have to check it out someday. I think the higher sulfur da I think the sulfur daggers are still going for 1.2 mil. Really? That's a lot. That's nice. 
1.2 mil for a nice collection lock slot. That could be a good that could be a good way to go. All right, I'm off. We got a long day at work tomorrow. Have a good night and pray to Zamorak for good drops. Thank you very much, Matt. I appreciate the the blessing of the RNG and you have a nice night and a good day at work tomorrow. You take care, my friend. Always nice to see you. I'll see you next time. Yeah, the weapons have like four different attacks, and then your gear each has its own ability. Oh, that's kind of cool. There's a lot of different ways that different games do combat, and, and old school RuneScape is a very, uh, very simple way of doing it. But it has its, uh, it has a certain appeal, you know. Thank you. Later, you take care, Matt. Always nice to see you. There's like a hundred weapons and different variants on gear. Oh wow, so a lot more, uh, a lot more there then. Yeah, that's something that's unfortunate about RuneScape, but oh, but about OSRS specifically. Maybe the RS3 is the same way, but I can't speak to it. Just about how uh, there's so many items and weapons in the game, but so many of them are just obsolete because they're not best in slot. So I'd love to see a little bit more, you know, a little bit more. And they're they're working on it. I think they've done a fine job at uh, at working on it, but there's still a little ways to go with that, you know. Oh, my bad. They dropped hard. 650k on the hand. Oh, really? So they went down. I guess they used to be higher then. Still not too bad. I wonder what they're used for, though. Hey, good luck and have a good stream. Hey, you take care, Terry. I appreciate you being here, friend. Very nice to see you. Yeah, it's a shame because they got so many items that haven't been touched in a decade or two. Yeah, that is unfortunate. Definitely. Probably pray piety here. Whoops. <clears throat> That's what I like about Albion. Every weapon has a use depending on what you're using. That's nice. Yeah. That is nice. I'll have to check out Albion one of these days. What if you like to skill or PvP? The PvE is alright, but they got mass teams versus team PvP. Interesting. I've never been a huge PvPer, but maybe I'd get into it someday. One more hit, please. Never. Very sad. Oops. <clears throat> yeah, the skilling is fun. You find different resources and gather them and can travel on your own giant yak. Oh, that's fun. At guild bases, guild bases, and you can raid territories. That's kind of cool. So, do you have to participate in the PvP, like the PvP part? Well, I can't speak in the PvP part. Or are you able to uh, only do the other kind of stuff? You can do whatever you want. Nice, nice. So you're not missing out on a ton, a ton if you don't do it. 
Oh, you're falling asleep. You're attacking a sulfur Nagua. <laughs> she wasn't kidding when she said she was tired, folks. Luckily, an item right here. Ooh, very sad. Barrow's luck is coming to haunt her at uh, Perilous Moons as well. You hate to see it. <clears throat> Just some areas are left wilderness. Oh, okay, that makes sense. No, don't say that. <laughs> hopefully not, Sarah. Hopefully not. Surely not, right? Yeah, but the difference in the uh, the game is you specialize in what you want to do, so some become so you can become the best fire staff maker. Interesting. Okay, the best cloth armor maker. Very interesting. Ooh, just barely got the blood moon. Very nice. They would add D Long and free to play him to, uh, to free to play in Magic Sharpo. That'd be interesting. I guess I forgot that Magic Sharpo wasn't free to play. Nothing from Moons today. Very sad. All right, folks. I'm gonna go to the bathroom really quick. Grab a quick snack. I'll be back in just a few minutes. Until I'm back, please enjoy the music. And I love you. And I'll see you soon. Bye.
Hey folks, sorry for the extra long delay. My son actually woke up and he's uh, he's having a rough night and so I think I'm gonna go help him out and uh, see if I can get, can't get him back to sleep again. My wife's doing it too, so. Give me, um, well, I think, I think I'm just gonna call it honestly because otherwise I'm, I'm not sure when I'll be back. Sorry about the, the, the um, quick delay there or the quick ending there, but I love you all. I'll be live again tomorrow. If you'd like to join my stream tomorrow, then I'll get you a link really quick for that. Um, let me see that here. Basically, just go ahead and click on this link here. I'll be live again tomorrow. Hit notify me. Uh, I love you all. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Again, I'm sorry, and uh, bye. <laughs>